The city of Thunder Bay is imposing stiffer penalties on owners of pets who repeatedly engage in nuisance-related behaviors. That decision came at Monday's council meeting and officially amended the city's animal bylaw. Some of the stiffer penalties will happen for owners whose pets repeatedly defecate on other people's land, threaten people or other animals, and are found on school property during hours when students are outside. The recommendation was in response to an increased number of calls in recent years, specifically involving the same animals. City Licensing and Enforcement Manager Doug Vincent says the bylaw is meant to address repeat offenders. By creating a fence that shows a public nuisance, it is a, a nuisance to the public to have the same person, the same animals repetitively at large. We would then use that section alternately to somebody who just their dog got away and was running at large. We may or may not issue a, a ticket. They may get a warning. But this signifies that uh, this is a real problem uh, uh, situation and that we are looking for a stiffer pe penalty. The exact amount for the fines will be set by the courts, but is expected to be more than the current fine for animals running at large, which is $200.